Well, uh, it's the first time we'll see him live action. I think people will absolutely love him. He's, it's funny, it's moving, and it's really true to the spirit of Michael Bond's original creation. What's so satisfying is Michael saw it uh, uh, this week and uh, gave it his, you know, sign of his, his approval. He absolutely loved it, and that is incredibly gratifying. I mean, what's the magic of Paddington, and why was it so hard to find the right voice? Well, uh, uh, the magic of Paddington. Paddington is a very generous spirit. And one of the things I love about Paddington is about the kindness of strangers and kindness to strangers. It has a very generous spirit. And uh, uh, so I, I think that's really the key, the essence of it. Um, why did it take a while to find the voice? Well, we began with Colin Firth, and he was wonderful. But um, as he felt and we felt, ultimately, when you put him with our bear, his voice was too mature. You know, it, he has a wonderful sort of chocolatey voice. And it just didn't fit. So we went for someone a little younger in, in, in spirit, more uh, and, 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 and that was Ben. And he's got a, Ben has a voice that's a little bit other and uh, it just suits the bearer perfectly. Talking about magic, of course, fans are very excited that we're going to be returning to the Potter uh, universe. Um, what can we expect from that, and uh, how excited are you to be involved in that again? I'm thrilled to be involved. You know, uh, Joe has such uh, an incredible and vivid imagination to be a part of anything she creates is a, is a privilege. And I'm, you know, it's early on in the adventure, but I'm really excited. Nicole, uh, speaking on the darker side of Paddington, um, is a wonderful villainess. Can you talk about bringing her on board for this project? Yeah, no, that was, you know, uh, really went to Nicole and she said yes. We went, whoa, it was, it, was, it was incredibly exciting. She uh, it plays the, the, the wicked taxidermist who's trying to stuff Paddington. Uh, and I think is a, um, uh, you know, she has such a great sense of humor. Paul and I are big fans of To Die For, and, 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 and she can be so wonderfully icy and, 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 and wickedly funny, and I think she brings that very much to, to this. Hugh Bonneville, who we know most recently from Downton Abbey, it's great to see him get, have the opportunity to flex his comedic muscles because he is very, very, very funny. Uh, Sally Hawkins, you know, one of the great actresses uh, working today, and she brings such heart and, 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 and wonder to, 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 to Mrs. Brown. Judy Walters, what does one need to say? You know, I've had the pleasure of working with her on quite a few films, and she brings energy and fun. I mean, every scene she's in, she just shines and then we've got two wonderful young actors Sam and Maddie uh, playing you know Jonathan and Judy and uh, you know, they, they both had experience before uh, um, Maddie and um, largely in television Sam was in the impossible and they uh, they, they play the young Browns and they are one you know, it, it's a great cast it's uh, we they everybody you know my, both Paul King's script I mean, everybody loves Paddington that was the first thing. But Paul King's script was brilliant, and it was a real magnet for, for, for talent. So uh, we, we've been very lucky in the process. You think this is the first of many big screen adventures for Paddington? You know, um, I hope so. I mean, you have no idea. I've just, you know, all one does, one doesn't look at it in terms of a franchise or in terms of sequels. I've always worked in making the best film one can. So even on the Potters, it was make the first film as good as it can be. And if it's good, then the rest will follow. Uh, so too with the second, third, fourth and beyond. That's the approach here is let's make a really good film. I think we have. I'm really proud of it. And uh, uh, hopefully uh, audiences will feel as, as, as positive about it as, as we all do.